All right, guys, welcome to that Switch Twitch. Julian had an idea for a video today. He is going to play Pokemon Sword, and he is going to beat the Fire Gym. So Julian has already beat Pokemon Shield, correct? Yes. So he's already beat Shield. So if you've never watched these, if you never watched the channel before, we do family-friendly videos, no cursing, nothing crazy like that. Lots of Let's Plays, have some unboxings, all that good stuff. We got a new setup here, so hopefully you guys appreciate the up the production value. So Julian, go ahead. Show, show us show us what we're doing today. So good. So apparently you have to do stuff if you want to challenge the actual gym leader. So, See these gym leaders? Yeah. You think you're supposed to fight them. No, they help you defeat different Pokemon. Oh, so you don't and battle this, those people. So, and this is our leaderboard. Uh-huh. And then when you get enough points, um, we um, get to fight the gym leader, Kabu. Okay, well, let's and do this. Let's try this Vulpix that we're trying to So run into a wild Pokemon like Vulpix. Uh-huh. So, so I... it's easier because it's just one Pokemon. Huh. So so you see they don't send out fire type Pokemon. Like he sent out the Rock Holy. And as you can see I I named my Pokemon Rufy, which is level 27. Oh, nice. So, for, um, so Julian's uh, a little bit attack. higher level. There we go. Sorry about that, Jay. I had to move where we are in the camera. So normally... And a wing attack did a bunch of damage. Nice. That, that's a pretty strong move. So I've only done, I think, Pokemon Blue version. I think I played a little bit of gold or silver. I don't know. I think... Uh, Cute. How did that rock type not be good against it? Oh well, it's well. So wing should wing type should be pretty good against it. Oh, I call you tackle. Use, and let's use another wing attack to kill that Volpix off. It did a little bit of damage, but he can still. Do you have any potions? Yep, I do. Nice. So All it's right. got the so. potions, but we don't got any good stuff for CP. We don't. Oh, that no. stinks. So that's one point for us, and let's um, heal up with just a regular potion. Okay, let's now, heal up with a regular potion. And now let's fight some different Pokemon. Alright, let's do there's it. different Pokemon on the on here, like there's some fire and ghost. Okay. Like this. Ooh, Litwick. He looks cool. Does he and evolve he, into Candelabra? Um, he, I remember one of them being... Chandelure. Chandelure, that's what it is. I was close. Candelabra, Chandelure. Alright, so... So... Ooh, that was pretty good. Wait, so uh, my wing attack is super oh, effective against but, his... But you got caught in his rap. So there's different moves, like, um... Sand... Sand, like sand? Um... Something which tra it's like whirlpool that traps them in um something. Yeah. And there's like flying, which it still which it pretty much says the same thing. Cool. And that's also another point. So you just fight all these Pokemon until until um you get enough points to fight Kabu. Oh, and, and that. And you find some different. Sizzly peed. Sizzle peed. Sizzle peed. Whoa. Cool. It's cool that it helps you. Yeah, but but the Salon did. Salon did? Yeah. Yeah? You, when I beat at this dude from before. Yeah. But the sandal it doesn't help at all. He just weakens me, not hmm. weakening the opponent. So just go for a super effective wing attack. Okay. Oh, Rufy Flinch can't move. And then he uses the bite. Let's try that again with a, let's try another wing attack on Sizzle P. It's nice that it tells you what's super effective. Yeah, because usually games they just like, if you don't know any types, like even if like the obvious, like fight is good against grass, you're, and you yeah. just use tackle, the thing it's good. Super that's effective. obvious, but like yeah. ghost versus steel, that's not so obvious, or ghost versus dragon, it's like wood. Would a dragon be scared by a ghost? Or would a ghost be scared by a dragon? Who knows, right? Yeah. Exactly. Oh, shoot. I gotta plug. I plug in the laptop. So you, um, just keep fighting these guys over and over again. Okay. 
and you just do it over and over again until you get enough points of like a kabu, which there's going to be fire types like. It says so effect, so all of them are effective, not super effective. So if so, you what see retaliate. Retaliate. What is that? So do? if you press Y, yeah, you can see you have like, the damage. On oh, okay. Point. Power sixty, accuracy a hundred. And you got these ones. Okay. And and so far I'm the strongest um flying type move that Ooh. I got is was that, um, was that a critical hit? A will o' wisp. Ooh, looks like a ghost type move. No. Oh, it's fire type move. It's purple fire. Yeah. Oh. What did it do there? It did a little bit of damage. It did some. I hurt by the burn, but it spun around and did some damage back to Vulpix. Alright, take him out. That's because um he used the move on him. And if you wanted to, you could attack the Roly Coley? No. But it, you have to attack the Vulpix. I know, but did it give you the option to? So yeah, it looks like it your Pokemon need to get healed up, right? Yeah, that's why you always have some potions. That's why I always have some good potions and some revives. Okay. Oh, yeah, you got we, ten we, potions. Yeah, I got some bomb heals to help. Yep. Oh, because it's a fire gym, right? Yeah. Yeah, you need burning heals for that. Yeah, um, I didn't get them. I was battling a trainer mm -hmm. named Moni. So do you have enough points yet on the board? And so um, when I fought him, it's, if you can know when you have enough points, like... Pretty much, why not? You can match with go to um, Kabu. Uh huh. And you can also, there's also no effect. Hmm. So, let's go for a wing attack. Okay. And let's try to. Win. Yeah, like you'd think, yeah, wing attacks would be good because it would, like, it would blow out the fire, right? Like flying type moves, that'd be good. Yeah. But. But there's, but flying, she's also a ghost, which she, there's no candle types. She just said candle. It's not usually just like, so yeah. Hmm, I'm or, learning a lot. What if like a fire is like. Ooh, your roofy level like, up. Like it just been, goes somewhere else to spread it. And it's still a little bit. And it looks like I beat him off. And now. I like his mustache. And now it's time to fight the Kabu gym leader. Alright. So back. let's take a look. Everyone take looks like they're healed, right? They got full energy? Yeah. So, let me, so I always know the nine tails. We got, um, we're gonna need to some bond heals. Cause they like going for Will O' Wisp. And Will O' Miss, and Will O' Wisp does burn damage, right? Mm -hmm. Got it. Very cool. So that's the fire gym leader right yeah. there? Is this your version or is this mom's version? It's mine. It's yours? Yes. Okay. So I'm gonna send out my Luffy, just um, a backup to kill the nine tails. He can be a nice, good backup. The fact that here means you've bested both Miles Grass type and Nessa's water type too. So this is the third gym? Yep. Okay. Like a each starter type. So very interesting. So you don't do the normal battle the other trainers in the gym before you battle the gym leader. So pretty much the next gym bit, the, f the second gym I'm going to see is yeah. going to be on the dry one, but that's the last one I have to get. Gotcha. For that, I, I would have to fight the ghost, but instead it's a fighting. Hmm. Is that because it's sword? It's different? Uh -huh. Oh. So the gyms are different so in different goes, versions. So wing attack to try to kill out its... So you see they always go for will wisp like that. Hmm. Ooh, and he burned right away. Yeah, you were yeah. right. Okay. So let's get in a wing attack. Get a wing attack in. So you're a little bit higher level, but... Yeah. Doing some burn He's Pokemon are pretty strong, though. He does have pretty strong Pokemon. Do you want to use that burn heal right away, or...? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, why would you wait? One more thing is, is that counts as your move. So if he burns you again, uh, Ember won't do burn. Oh, it did! Ember does damage, and it has a chance. Oh, 
Okay. So I don't, I'm, maybe we should have not. That's what I was thinking. Yeah. yeah so let's use all my 70 damage moves. Retaliate. Yeah. Retaliate. Okay. Yeah, he's doing some more damage. Got about half health there. He is a strong one. Oh, nice. How much damage is that going to do? That didn't do any damage yet. Yes, it did. Did it? Yes. Okay. Here. Are you going to have enough health, or do you need to... Oh, it's, what's this? Oh, it's going to Dynamax? I have... This is my first time actually, like, paying attention to, like, a full battle. Like, Dynamax, um, your Pokemon gets stronger. Oh, no. Your Pokemon gets stronger. Yeah. But you can only, um, do you, that for You three have, times. like, 16 health. What should you do? Oh, 7 health. What are you going to do? I have to do one more damage off. I just use him to... Do some good amount of damage. Oh, and then you're gonna use your other Pokemon? How many Pokemon does this gym leader have? Um, gym leaders, you have like a full team, while the gym leaders barely got any. That's what I was thinking. Later on, the gym leaders have a full team, right? Or like almost a full team? Yeah, like, so pretty much until you battle all the gym leaders, yeah. then you, um, there's like um, different ones that you like. That turn makes them sense. Different oh, you can learn a electric type move? Oh, and yeah. a flying and a bug type. That's pretty versatile, Butterfree. Of I, course. Isn't that going to be super effective? No. It no? does zero damage. It just burns. Oh, it just burns. Okay. So let's go for uh, as fast a chance of flinching. Ooh, that was good. I think got a critical hit there. If he can flinch, that'd be great. Yeah, that was a great move. If he can flinch, that'd be good. That would be good. So, yeah, so the trainers... So that's super effective, but yep. I just sent out... Um, but if he to finish them off, and I don't, like, usually it's like a piece of cakes, because the first gym leader only has got two fast ones. Oh, oh your Dreadnought went up, nice. Yeah, my Dreadnought's, Dreadnought's pretty strong, but you have to pretty much beat the, if you want to get him right off the back, okay. you have to um, get him from, after you beat Nessa, if it's a cave that you unlock. Mm-hmm. And that's where some, um, <clears throat> where that's where you find a Drenol. Hmm. Learning so much. And then the Drenol is like a strong one. Ooh, that did a lot of damage. Oh, super effective. So we're gonna. I know I beat the game, so I'm gonna. So I know what the final Pokemon's gonna be. It's a Sizzlepeed. Ooh, and he looks with, cool. What's that? Is that Drenol. his actual name, or is that the nickname you gave him? Nope. Journal. He's a water type, right? And rock. Oh, water and rock. So he looks like a combination. He's on um, a sand tom. Yeah, that's what it's called. So this traps them in um something. Mm. So that sh looks like Blastoise and something else put together. Sand tomb, huh? Okay. Ooh, nice. Now he's gonna be stuck in it's that. It's super effective. But but it oh, really it doesn't was, that much damage. But it traps him in quicksand. Just, yeah. But it looks See, like that's it's, why it's helpful. Because it traps him in that thing. Oh, it gets hurt by the sand tomb. Nice. That's a that's a good and move. And now this huge rock tomb bad one that now actually we need rock does tomb. Damage. Ooh. I think. Oh, oh man, flinch. So you were saying there's a chance you'd make your guy flinch, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's, that's good. Um, it's still doing damage. Yeah. It only lasted for five times. Hmm. So that should. I hope I don't flinch. Don't, yeah, flinch. don't flinch. Yes. Yeah. No. Rock Tomb. Rock Tomb. Nice. Super effective. Uh, and his speed fell. Oh, so you speed should be, fell. Nice. You should be able to do a little bit more damage. And it got. Okay. Oh, that's cool. So the Sand Tomb effect keeps going. Yeah, for five times. Gotcha. So let's um, do a bite since I have a lot of CP for it. Yeah. Is that going to be enough to take him out? So it's always good if you have extra team members on your party, use them so they cannot, so they lose a gigantic mask and you still got use it. Use them. That's so, that. so don't use the one that you're going to gigantic mask. Uh huh. Or if just dynamax. Sent a scorch, huh? So this is going to lose one ton of this thing. Uh huh. So we got to keep using it. Ooh. It looks cool. But I got a flying type, so and he's level 
body something. So he's like a fire and a bug type, that sent to Scorch? Or just a fire type? He's a fire and a bug. Okay. Da, 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 da. Music's pretty catchy. So usually if you are challenging the ghost gym, um, usually um, pretty much, pretty much um, if you want to challenge a ghost gym, they have the G-Max Gengar, but if you're challenging a fighting gym, a G-Max Machamp. Each one you, have, you get it from evolving. Mm-hmm. So yeah. Nice. He, so Whoa. he has. So he's a bug. So he used Max Flutterby. Dreadnought fainted. Oh boy. Are you gonna be able to win this battle? Yes, I will. I got okay. extra Pokemon. I didn't. This is my height level. Pokemon. Oh yeah, I didn't see him. Yeah, and I'm gonna Gigantamax him. So he's super effective. Who are you gonna Gigantamax? Machop? No. Oh, he's cute. He's gonna kill. He's gonna kill. He might got. He might get killed. But maybe if I can do a little bit damage. Yep. So if he kills me, then that's okay, because that uses a roundup. Gima, oh boy. That looks like that's going to take you out. Oh, you survived it. Yes. So you'll be able to do some so, damage. So I'd be able to do some damage? Yeah. Oh, not very effective, though. That's and then that burn. Okay. Now, one more dude, and one, if I send out one more guy... Yeah. Then he should be able to um, lose his Gigantamax, and I use my um, super effective Ooh, flying. That's that's a grass type. Isn't he going to be in trouble? No, I I'm yes he is, but I'm trying to lower him so he's not. No gotcha. More so just anybody, so you'll sacrifice. So what's better, payback? So it's, yeah, because grass type moves on that good. That's a dark type. Oh boy, I don't think he's going to survive. If he can't survive, it's okay. Okay. Well. Huh. Now you lost it. Now I can use on my Gigantamask. Oh, on yeah. On that Noibat. Right. Which has a super effective air slash. Because, a chance of flinching Because his Gigantamax back. only lasts for a couple Three turns. Times. Oh, okay. So, see? Now now I'm going to Gigantamax my dude. Oh, that was very smart. So I now you. he does a little bit damage on him. Now let's use the Max Air Stream. To be super effective on him. Oh, that's gonna take him out right away, huh? I know. So that's why you. So if you, you look at leftover Pokemon, oh, you use them first. Yeah. You are good, my friend. So don't <coughs> drag the Intimax fast thing. Because they're obviously gonna use Lava Drag Intimax and they're like, gonna be like, oh no, what should I do? Because you don't have your Drag Intimax. Well, oh. why don't you. Wait, that didn't that didn't one hit him? That's all right. Well, well, he is a fire gym. He's oh, and your speed stuff. rose. He's coil. That's not gonna do anything. Is that just gonna rise his defense? He wants to rise his defense. Yeah. Oh, attack. Oh, and defense. And oh, so. And, and accuracy, huh? Okay. Okay, let's go for a max airstream. Oh, and, defense and rise. this one should take him out, and that's his last yeah. Pokemon, right? Yeah. So that's so how you got. So the gigantic mask. The gig. Gigantamax. Yeah. That um. But that was a Dynamax. It says that yes. same thing. Yeah. So pretty much, if that happens, that means um, that's your last Pokemon. Okay. Normally, they they wouldn't use their Gigant or their Dynamax first move, right? No. You want to save it toward the end. Unless if you're um. Okay, so you got some. Unless if you're battling a random person, sometimes they just Gigantamax random. That was a great battle. All right, so we learned a couple things today, or I did at least. Okay, so you got to be smart with when you use your Dynamax, right? So this unlocks a new area where um, and you it unlocks get to a new see area? Um, a Dragon Gym. Okay. Which you can... Um, okay, yep, so there which, you can see um, that... Pretty much you can find the wild area, which has such good Pokemon, like Gengars, Haunted, all that. Gotcha. So, so time out, real quick. So, in order to get to the gym leader, first thing is you have to beat those Pokemon, and the other people help you. So it's not like a normal gym battle. Uh, second, you want to be smart when you use your Dynamax, right? Dynamax mm -hmm. only lasts for three turns. Yeah. And third, you said that in Sword, there's the Dragon Gym or the Ghost Gym. So there's in Sword, there's a Fighting Gym, and um Shield. Yeah. Um. 
is a ghost gym. Gotcha. So, so you can see they give you TMs. The first one is Magical Leaf. Yeah. And the second one is Whirlpool. And now now it's with a Wisp that nice. you get. And then I I know what the... the head, um, and you get a uniform. It's yeah. a ghost one. Very cool. So you get a fire uniform. So that's what one, you get for being And it. you also have to buy some different uniforms. Yeah. That's... Um, since they're not in the game. Yeah. Very cool. So, so we have a rival called Hop. He always, he chose um, the one that you're super effective against. Yeah. And he gets some good Pokemon. You. So yeah. All right. And that's it for today. All but, right. But let's see. But I gotta show you where you wanna go. One more thing, and then we'll wrap. Where you wanna video? go okay. after you beat the fire gym? Got it. Okay. Just in case, if you don't know what to do. Uh huh. So of course you have to get out, and Hop always kind of talks to you since you just beat a gym. And also, when you go more, you might you you get lead cards, and there's also some rare lead cards. Kabu's is a slight different. She just has a shiny thing. I don't really think that his thing is really that different, mm -hmm. but everybody else's is different. Hmm. And there's also the ice gym, which is the same, but but in Pokemon Sword, there's a boy, and in Pokemon Shield, it's a girl. Oh. Okay. So you're gonna show everybody where to go now, right? Yes. Okay. So you that's the map. So good thing I don't have to walk there. So you so this is what you gotta do. What do you got to do? This hop just lets you go right here. So don't, so i show you where to go after hop leads you right here. Mm -hmm. And they show you that go down there. Mm -hmm. And then you see that bridge? You go straight from that bridge. Yeah. And you should see a castle. So they couldn't let you go in. Except until um, pretty much you um, find a, get the fire badge. Okay. So you might see the giant gym, but but you can't challenge it. So don't go in there. To try to challenge it. So the one. So probably you have to challenge um. The, probably the ghost gym. I'm learning so much about Pokemon Sword. Right. So you, there's also like another character that you don't really battle him that much, but his name is Beat. He likes to use psychic type Pokemon, which are weakened by dark and also weakened by psychic. psychic. Yeah. What about ghost? Oh wait, it's ghost is weakened by. That's what I thought. Because um, because I I played this game before, mm -hmm. and um, I teach my Electio, um, Hex, and it was super effective against speed. Nice. So. So uh, let's give you um. You gonna show everybody where to go? Show. So go straight down here, and if you get distracted because it's a raid battle, you can always just go there. You could. Like you can also like go here. But we're press not gonna do a, that, right? So you can get some W. Oh. So okay. So that that's wasn't what a raid it gives you. Okay. But it's not a raid battle. Raid battles have a red thing shooting straight oh, like that. Oh, gotcha. So you can have you have to so you get the gigantic mask. Mm -hmm. And if you win. If you want to catch them, you can catch them. But if you no one catches them, you don't have to catch him. Well, he's looking straight down. You can still talk to him. And at the end of this bridge, do not fight that extremely strong Pokemon. Don't fight him at the end of the bridge, huh? Yes, it's a super strong Pokemon. The Motostrike River Bank Wild Area, okay. So, because usually a Snorlax pops, pops up right here. So, he's super strong. So you better be careful, because one time your rival's going to have a wild small axe. Oh, gotcha. Those look like Rhydons, I think. My whole team just or lost Rhydons. to Rhydons. Rhydons. Yeah, not Rhydons. Just lost to a small axe. Got it. That's so you get, cool. so if you see a shiny thing, press A. So it's normally an item, pretty right? Much, yeah, item. So you can, so these Pokemon, they can drag you in a mess, but you can still catch him. Okay. If you want to catch them, you can. There's like rhino horns. <laughs> I don't know why we really like. And rock bullies, you don't have to catch them. You can get them on your own game. Gotcha. Rumbly. 
So is uh, bum, bum. is this what you wanted to show everybody, Julian? So now there's um lots of pool mine in the water. You can go to that island, um, but you can also go fishing if for some pool mine water. But you can unlock this, so you have to challenge the ice gym. Mm -hmm. Then you should be able. That's how you. So, You'd be able to so freeze the can, water um, to like. No, you um. So you see this Rotom bike? Yeah. You can now make it. It ran on the water. I gotcha. So, question, because you were trying to wrap it up. Is this where you want to show everybody where to go? So, if you can see that little sand, then you're close the way. Okay, so like. go ahead and show everybody. I just want to make sure. So, I haven't seen this part. So, so usually you have to change this Pokemon likes to pop up, which is um, Score Vets Evolve form. Right, so, you're going to go through the stony you, um, can Score Vets, they're really not bad. Where you give him, like, like I'm a thing um, what you usually get. Why didn't you want to check inside that thing? What if there was money in there? And there's, um... Oh, you have to battle her because she saw you? Oh, no, no you, don't. you can always just run away. Okay. Like that. So, this, so if you can always find some wide Pokemon, like... Do you want that one? You don't have to catch them, but you can always get them. So if you want to just fight them, like this... Like She's a pretty attack. high level. She's level 36. Yeah, but... What's, but Wing is super effective against him. See that family did damage there. So that's damage, not very effective. So Wing attack is super effective. Super I'm effective. And the hail's hurting her too. Oh, you're getting hurt by the hail too. Yeah. Okay. Do it again. So, what are you gonna so, do? Are oh, you just gonna run? Okay, just run. Yeah. Got it. Okay. Learning. Oh, you couldn't get away. Oh away. no, she's not gonna make you sleep, is she? Confused. Confused. Cause don't be worried. Don't try to exactly heal up right away. Cause there's also a chance you cannot get confused. She can. Your Pokemon can break through the confusion. Yeah. Why would it do the same move? You're already. Confused. Well, sometimes that kind of gives you an advantage. <clears throat> if they use, if you're right. That, like that, thing or that. But you can also get hurt by the hail. If you, maybe you, if you like got a super slow Pokemon, mm -hmm. like um, there's one Pokemon that's super <coughs> slow, but he knows a super strong move called Power Whip. Who's that? Um, it's um, I caught one before, and and I named him. Your Pokemon's thing. gonna faint. Well, you can know that's why you can always go to um. Pokemon Center. Yeah, which. Do you want to battle her or you just want to run away? Well, the thing is, um... You want to catch her, I right? I couldn't because it said you couldn't get away. So that's why let's have my stronger one. That she has the air slash a chance of flinching and do you really have to go for Tia Dance. Okay. So Tia Dance, I hope he... I hope oh, made you that confused. Can break through it. Yeah, so... So, so you see that? She broke through the confusion. So now, that do you want to try to catch her change. now that she's weakened or no? Let's try to catch her. Yeah, cause she's pretty high level. Yeah. Okay, so let's see how you catch Pokemon. So you got different Pokemon. Pokeballs, heal balls. You have a lot whenever of you balls. heal, Whenever you catch a Pokemon, they heal. Net balls, Primea balls, and nest balls, friend balls, great balls, boy balls. Dust balls, and then that's it. Okay, so what are you gonna use? A heal ball so I can heal up. Oh, good idea. Wait. What? Sometimes it doesn't let you do wait, that. Wait, wait, hit B, hit B. Go back to the bag. There you go. It won't let its guard down. You need to do a little bit more damage. What are you gonna do so you don't hurt her? Wait, I should just um heal, I should just revive my other Pokemon, because what if a heal doesn't do that much damage? Yeah, who would be, maybe somebody do a little bit of damage, but not... Is oh yeah, oh yeah, let the heal, let, let the hail do the damage. Yeah. Good, good call, okay. Santa, she has some super strong moves. Got it, She okay. used Magical Leaf, let do a little bit of damage. Not very effective, okay. So she gets hit by a heal. That should be enough. Yes! Now she would be good. She should, she should be, be good. good to catch. Jay, you're, you're out of the camera. Come back. Come back. Then, <laughs> Come back more. Wait, what? Camera's right there. So she can't let her go down. So, so what do you do? Yeah. Do you make her sleep? You're you just going to have to beat have her. To, you have to kill her. Okay. So if, like, 
You should always look for the highest accuracy, like this, 95. Look for like something like 100 or quick Come attack closer. if it's like that. Okay. Weaken. So that's why you always swim. Okay, so, so now is, is she going to let her down her... You have right, to she's done. Her. Yeah. But you won't catch her if she faints, right? Yeah. Just like old Pokemon rules? Yeah. All right, so let's go to the point where you want to show everybody. So then we, so everybody gets that, a bunch of XP. Yep, everybody shares XP in this game without having a swap, which is cool. Yeah. yeah. It depends. Some people might not like that. So, like, um, it's cool since, like, like you really want, um, you really want to do something. So but change the camera angle so people can see where, you're, okay, so you're walking to that. Yeah, so there's this big tower. That's where you gotta go. Because you leave as a part of my bear that says, that you can, oh, but if you're way one here, mm -hmm. you can tell that he says, you need a fire badge to get past here. And there's a cool night. Gotcha. And there's all these such a cool Pokemon. Here's a way if you want to get fine Pokemon near you. Press your, press the down button that usually you move on mm. now. So if you click the, the actual thumbstick, so, so right? So you yep. this button, if click you... it down. Not yep. So you want to press on the thumbstick, got and it. And then put, and then Pokemon are flying, they get near you. Okay, those are Solar Rocks, I know them from Pokemon Go. So you can tell the Solar Rocks, sometimes they appear on that grave house. Oh, you found a large leak, you know exactly where that was. Oh yeah, I know what to do with it. You're going to give it to Farfetch'd? Right? Yeah, I, okay, so, so there's, um, apparently only Farfetch has, has to evolve with it. But right now, it doesn't. Now it lets you go to your box. And these are all the Pokemon. A Flareon, a Roo, a Luru, Otis, Pido, and a, I named them this. Since you is going to evolve into it. A Superclays. I don't feel like Drenals be really that good. Now, because you only have to give them leaks to get three kilo critical hits in a row to evolve them. That's what it takes to evolve them into Surfetched, huh? Yep. Okay. So you run up here. Yep. You can get that, um, you can get all that. Now, why don't you want to ride your Rotom bike? Wouldn't that be faster? Yes, you can also ro ride your Rotom bike if you want to speed things up. If, um, when you see your bike has some spark, press B to make it, like, that sparking. Oh, that's really and cool. So this is where you, you end up after you, you beat, have to beat the fire gym. All right, yep. I think this is the good stopping point yep. then, Jack. so let's save it, and S then... Save it here? All right, so really quick. Uh, that is how you beat the fire gym, and this is where to go right after you beat the fire gym. Uh, join the Pokemon experts. So if you want more uh, Pokemon videos, make sure you guys subscribe. Hit that like button. See you guys. See you guys.